this video and hundreds more like it available on free Photoshop video tutorials.com. In this video we're going to learn how to add a copyright watermark to your photos so that people will be less inclined to actually use them somewhere else or steal them and so forth. So first thing we need to do is uh, to just um, with our type tool here is uh, type in the copyright information that we want. So we'll, let's see here. We'll put in my photo 2009. So that'll be our copyright here. And what we'll do is we'll have it, uh, I'm just going to do a control and T and just uh, do this at 45 degree angle here by holding down shift. We get a 15, a uh, negative 15 degree angle here. And what we want to do is uh, have this copyright uh, go across our whole uh, photo here. So first of all, you need to pay attention to the size of the copyright uh, uh, text that you want to have. You don't want to go too big with the size of the image that you have. So in this in this case here, uh, eight point size uh, worked uh, really well here for this image here. Um, it sort of really depends on the, the, uh, the whole um, uh, DPI that you have set on your image and so forth. So it's just better to just type it out and reduce it to the size that you want. Once you're satisfied with that, then what you can go is make sure that we are in our type layer. We're going to select all, control A. We're going to do a copy, so it's control and C. Open a new document, so it's control and N. And press OK. That'll come out to the perfect size that it needs to be. And then we're going to do a control and V to paste. So we have just our text exactly to the size of the canvas. Right, so it's exactly the canvas is exactly the size of the text. We just need to delete our background layer here, so we have just the text and nothing else, just transparency. And now we're going to go into uh, edit and uh, define pattern. And with that, we can put in our this is will be our watermark. Okay. Once we're done with that, we can close our document. We don't need this anymore. We can go back in here into our um, original image here, delete that. And now we're ready to go. So, okay, so now what we can do is add a new layer. And in this new layer, we're going to go into Edit, Fill, and we're going to fill it in with our pattern. So make sure we got pattern, and our pattern is selected as the one that we just created. And uh, we're just going to fill that in. So there we are. So we have our copyright information. Now, obviously, this is getting in the way. Uh, you want your copyright uh, watermark to be a little bit more subtle than this. So what you can do now is uh, just change the opacity here to overlay and um, then change the uh, opacity of it to something slightly less. So like uh, 20 percent for example. Just anything where you can still see the, uh, the, the watermark information but it's not getting in the way of the photo. So uh, something like 10 percent here it's a bit of a judgment call because you, some people could get away with this. So you want to go for something like 15, 20, 30 percent maybe. Um, so you can see a bit of your copyright information there, but it's not getting in the way of the photo. So you just need to strike that balance. And uh, there you are. If you enjoyed this video, show your support by subscribing, rating, and adding it to favorites. Leave comments on our website and we'll create even more videos that interest you.